right, oh, we're over here in Ontario, California at the Petro Truck Stop. I have not been here in a long time. I mean, probably 10 plus years since I've been here. It's $20 to park here if you don't buy fuel, but that's all right. Um, I just got done taking the side kit down. I put the side kit on while I was home mainly just to kind of change it up a little bit i want to do some more short stuff uh i've been doing a, a little bit of longer runs for a while and eh, i'm kind of happier doing the short stuff so uh we're going to switch it up a little bit i won't have the side kit up all the time it takes me about um about 30 minutes to take it down or put it up so the the hardest part is folding the tarp uh, that's that's the the most time-consuming is dealing with the tarp the panels you see how it, it kind of pieces together uh, And tomorrow we'll go out and I'll I'll, uh, I'll show you what it looks like I'll kind of put away and I'll talk about it, but uh, I figured I'd talk about it more when we're using it um, the uh, I don't use it on every load. Uh, I kind of know where I can go to load it um, and we're, we're picking up tomorrow see originally i put it on because i was going to pick up a load out of california that required a side kit but that didn't happen so uh i uh i can't drove i went ahead and drove over here i washed the truck today i'll show you that tomorrow it looks really good got all that salt and stuff off of it and i wanted to wash the side kit while i was on the truck it'd been about two years since i put it on so, uh, but I'm not going to use it all the time. So I know a lot of people, oh, it looks like a lot of work. It is, but I just like mixing it up a little bit. So, uh, anyway, uh, let's see what else. I know I've kind of been missing in action there for a while. Uh, I was at home, just been in family time. Um, we went, uh, Teresa and I took Brittany, my daughter. We went shopping in Tucson, um, and just kind of hanged out, hang out at home. Uh, yesterday was a rough day. I was doing my last couple loads of laundry, and when you believe it, my dryer quit yesterday. So I had to run around, buy a dryer, hook it up, and everything before I left, so that Teresa would have a, a dryer. Otherwise, it'd be a pain in the butt. So I had to get that done yesterday. So I actually did not leave till late last night, uh, and because I wanted to get over here in time for a parking spot over here in Ontario. And uh, like I said, it's been a long time since I've been here. Uh, so far, it's not that bad. I'm kind of parked in the corner. I'm watching a truck right there. He might be getting ready to hit something. I think the guy, the guy, he's in front of me. Oh, he's got it. He missed it. All right. Uh, so anyway, like I said, missing in action. We're going to get back in the groove. Uh, tomorrow we're loading, we're supposed to be loading big crates. That require eight foot tarps that was one reason why i took my side kit down uh because it's gonna require eight foot tarps um so let's see what else is going on uh did some work in the sleeper i'll show you that tomorrow i narrowed the bed a little bit uh just to give me a little bit more floor room uh, i'll show you that tomorrow um because we don't have to load till one o'clock tomorrow so and we're about an hour away, so I've got a little bit of time in the morning. So I plan on doing uh, a quick uh, a quick update in the morning. A quick update is when I use the phone, uh, take a video, and I'll edit it a little bit, but nothing too much. So other than that, everything's going pretty good. So uh, thanks for sticking with me. And um, we're going to get back in the groove. We're picking this up. We're taking it to Ohio. We've already got a reload out of Ohio going to Wisconsin. And we already got a reload out of Wisconsin going back down to Kentucky. So we are set up uh, and they're all good loads. So hopefully everything will fall into place. So that's what I'm hoping for. So, all right, thanks for watching. We're gonna get back in the groove and uh, talk to you later.